Welcome back to Uncreative Crowd. This week, we have a smart alarm clock for kids. So this is the TikTok Turtle by Imagine A. It has not yet been funded on Kickstarter because it just started today. So I wanna say thank you to Imagine for sending this out to me uh, so I could unbox it here and give my feedback before it even launches. Make sure you go check out their Kickstarter, like I said, just launched today. Um, go show them some love over there. The link will be in the description box below, but let's dig in. So I received this about a week ago. Gotta be honest, I've already opened it. My kids love it. But as I'm sure you can tell, this is probably a pink turtle by the pink box. So let's pop it open and immediately you're greeted by, hi, I'm Leilani. Turtle of the flowers. And then moving down here, we've got one minute setup instructions and a few tips for use. Let's pop this off. Here we go, we have the pink turtle. So this is actually a production product. This is not a prototype, this is the final product. They've already got their first batch done and ready to send out as soon as the Kickstarter campaign ends, which is super awesome. That is very rare. Over the last year that I've been doing Kickstarters, I think that's happened like once or twice. So that's super awesome with uh, the TikTok turtle here. We'll set that aside and continue checking out the box. Okay, so in here. So here we've got the manual, basic cleaning instructions, that type of thing. Uh, we've got the power brick, five volt, one amp power brick, pretty nice. And then we've got the micro USB charging cable. Uh, probably about three foot long cable. Push this box aside and get back to the real deal here. This turtle is amazingly soft. If you remember last week, I unboxed the headphones that were super soft. I said they were the best feeling headphones I've ever used. This is like that same silicone, ridiculously soft. So just looking at the turtle here, we pop the tail down. We've got the micro USB charging input because it does have a lithium ion rechargeable battery that lasts up to four days when fully charged. You got the logo and stuff down here. Where are the buttons? How do I turn this thing on? Oh, just wait. Boop. And then we turn it on. Bam. Look at that, 826. Hey. It's 826. So once you pop the top off, obviously you've got that power on off button, but you also can change all of the settings. So whether it be the time to go to sleep, the time to wake up, uh, the brightness of the lights, what musical tune you want to play, whether you want the smart alarm on, uh, I will get to that, don't you worry. Everything, you can change all of the settings right here. So I think one of the coolest features about this is the smart alarm. And by smart alarm, what they mean is this turtle has a three axis gyro sensor, which means this can sit on the bed next to your child while the child's sleeping. Based on your movements in the bed, it can sense when you're in that light phase of sleep, so it can wake you up then, rather than waking up your child when they're in their deep sleep, but when they're in their light, phase of sleep and they wake up, oh, it's wonderful. They are so happy. But that's what this alarm clock aims to do. And not only that, but it also has a sunrise light, which means when it's nearing time uh, for the alarm to go off, the lights, as you can see, all, there's all these lights, they will start lighting up one by one in the white LED to brighten the room. It's mimicking the effect of the sunrise, the sunlight coming into your bedroom, which naturally wakes you up. Now, it may be kind of hard to see just based on the lighting in this area, but there is a night light, which is red lights. Uh, the reason they chose to go with red lights rather than white lights is because I'm sure many of you have heard by now, but blue lights to the eyes help like stimulate the brain and keep you awake. Whereas non-blue hue lights, such as red, are not as hard on the eyes and actually help you to kind of settle down and fall asleep a little better and remain asleep. But with the nightlight, there is a timer, 10, 20, and 30 minutes. So as your children are going to sleep, all you do is turn the nightlight on and it will remain on for that length of time that you had set previously, and then it'll turn off. And then say they wake up in the middle of the night and they need that nightlight. All they have to do is tap it, the nightlight comes back on. Because it's portable, it doesn't need to be plugged into the wall. If they need to go to the bathroom, they can just take this with them and light the way. That way they don't fall, they don't trip, they're not turning on uh, hall lights or something like that. Whereas then you got that bright light and obviously wakes them up or makes them cranky, depending on your child. So that is a really neat feature about this. So as you can see on the shelf, there are two circles of numbers. On the inner circle, you have one through 12, indicating the hours. So obviously one o'clock through 12 o'clock. Then for the outer numbers, you start up here at zero, incrementing by five, making your way all the way back around to what would be 60 for 60 minutes. Just like on an analog clock, you've got the shorthand for the hour, longhand for the minute. As you can see, there are these two lights that are flashing, eight, 
40 because it is currently 840. So in this way, it helps children to understand how to read a clock, an analog clock that is. I know in this day and age, analog clocks seem to be getting further and further from us, but they're still very prevalent and it is good to know how to read a clock. It's really neat that it's got both like the analog portion while it also still has the digital right here on the screen. I know I mentioned the smart alarm, but there is also the option to not use the smart alarm and just go with a standard alarm clock based on the time only and not the sleep cycles. You can cycle through which, whether you want no alarm, the standard alarm, or the smart alarm. And you've got a few different tunes. I like this one. This one's my favorite. Oh, and I almost forgot. The way to turn off the alarm clock once it's started, obviously you can tap it and that will put it on snooze. Or you can shake it. You probably don't need to shake it quite that vigorously, but you just shake it and that will turn it off completely. Um, I mean, it won't turn the power off, but it will turn the alarm off. So all in all, the TikTok Turtle is a really neat product. Like I said at the beginning, my kids love it. Imagine I actually sent two, so my oldest daughter is sleeping with one right now, and she's been playing with it, turning the nightlight on, and just loves it. I almost forgot, there are actually three different colors of the Tic Tac Turtle. Obviously this is the pink one, but there's also a green one and a blue one. I believe their current shipping schedule is March, so that's like, not even two months away. And once again, make sure you go check out their Kickstarter campaign that just launched today. Go to their website, sign up for their newsletter so you have a chance to win a free TikTok turtle. And I think that's gonna be it for this video. I hope you guys enjoyed this. If you did, hit that thumbs up, hit that subscribe button if you're new. And as always, we will see you next week.